Hello AI enthusiasts, Luma AI Dream Machine is making a lot of buzz. Luma AI crossed 1 million users in just 4 days, whereas the same milestone was achieved by ChatGPT in 5 days. If you are not using Luma AI Dream Machine yet, you should. You can create amazing videos using its image-to-video generation features. Whether you want to create a droid explorer in Mystic Jungle video, a roaring robotic Tyrannosaurus Rex with red glowing eyes, a buffalo eating grass in a field, a lion walking in the jungle, an astronaut in a spacesuit exploring Mars, a Tesla car running on the highway at night, two AI humanoids standing and talking to each other in a modern AI lab, an astronaut floating near the event horizon of a black hole, or a zombie getting upset at a monster restaurant. All these videos were created using the image-to-video feature of Luma AI Dream Machine. You must be curious to know how these videos were created, what prompts were used, how images were generated, and what the workflow was to create these videos. Stick to the tutorial video till the end. Make sure to hit like for this tutorial and subscribe to this channel if you haven't yet, as I am going to explain the step-by-step -step workflow of these videos. So, let's start. In the previous video, where I provided Luma AI text-to-video prompt optimization tips, I mentioned that if you want to create amazing videos using Luma AI, you must use these 15 camera movements in the prompt. This video is a continuation of that. Let's understand this with an example. Let's say you want to generate a video of a lion walking in a dense jungle. We can achieve this in three steps. First, we will generate a text-to-image prompt where the camera angle must be included. To generate a prompt, we will use this prompt template where I have already mentioned all the camera angles and movements. Now, we will simply copy this prompt, go to ChatGPT, and paste this prompt in the prompt box. Then, we will enter the scene here, which is Lion Walking in Jungle. We will ask ChatGPT to provide a medium-length text-to-video prompt with the scene Lion Walking in Jungle. Then hit the enter button. ChatGPT will analyze all the camera angles and create a prompt for text to video with the best camera angle suited for this scene. And you can see that the result has been generated here. In the result, we have the scene description, then details about the camera angle, and finally the prompt for video creation. You can observe how amazingly ChatGPT has created this prompt. In the video creation prompt, ChatGPT mentioned using a tracking shot showing the lion from a low angle, with steady movement, and the camera moving in harmony with the lion's pace. So our amazing prompt is ready. Just select this prompt and copy it. Now either you can use this prompt directly with Luma AI to generate text to video, as I generated this one using this prompt and keeping the enhance prompt feature on, you will end up generating a decent video. But if you want to get amazing results, then let's go to step two. In step two, we will generate an image using this prompt. To do so, we will go to leonardo.ai, then select 124 by 768 resolution in the left sidebar. Then select Leonardo Diffusion XL as the fine-tuned model and paste the prompt here in the prompt box. Then click on the generate button. This will take a few seconds and you can see that our image is ready and it looks really amazing. Now download the image you like. Now it's time to generate the video in step three. To generate the video, let's go to Luma AI Dream Machine, then click here to upload the image. Once the image is uploaded successfully, enter the same prompt here. Remember to turn on the Enhance Prompt option. Then click on the Send button to generate the video. You can see that our video generation has been queued. This will take a few minutes, and finally, here is our video. Similarly, I generated this video of Droid Explorer in Mystic Jungle, and this video of a roaring robotic Tyrannosaurus Rex with red glowing eyes, and all these videos as well. Now, if you want to know the prompt and workflow of all these videos, then you can use this amazing website known as CoverR.co. I have provided my CoverR.co profile link in the description. Just click on the link, and you will reach my CoverR.co profile. This is an amazing website where you can get the workflow and prompts for all my image and video creations. 
Now, if you want to see the workflow of this video, simply click on View AI Workflow. Here, you can see that the video was generated in two steps. Step one is image generation, and you can see that I used Leonardo AI tool to generate the image for this video. You can also see the prompt used to generate the image. For our convenience, there is a copy prompt option available here. Then, step two of this workflow is video generation. Here, you can see that I used the Luma AI tool for video generation. This is the prompt to generate the video. Now, if you want to see workflows from different creators, simply click on AI workflows in the top nav bar. You will reach a page where you can see the images and videos created by multiple creators. If you want to see the workflow of any specific image or video, simply click on view AI workflow. Also, if you want to get featured on this website, you can submit your own workflow. To do this, click on Submit a Workflow and Get Featured. Then, click on Submit Workflow. Here, you need to upload your video. Click on Select File to upload your video. Once the video file is selected, check this option and then click on Submit a Prompt and Start Upload. You will reach a screen where we need to click on the Add Details button to add workflow details. Next, we need to select the workflow type. Since we are generating an image to video, we will select image to video. Next, we need to enter the name for this workflow. Then click on add steps. Now we need to add all the steps involved in this video generation. In step one, we generated an image. So here we will select image generation. Then we need to select which tool we use to generate the image. Next, we need to enter the prompt used to generate the image. If you want to add some additional information, you can add that here. Now we need to add step two. Again, select step type. As we are generating a video in step two, we will select video generation. Then we need to select the tool used for video generation. Next, we need to enter the prompt for the video generation. If we want to add additional information, we can add that here. Then click on the save button your workflow will be saved. Now to publish this workflow, simply click on the publish button. Now our workflow will be reviewed by the cover.co team. Once it is approved, we will see this green publish button. Once it is published, your workflow will be visible to everyone. You can see it by clicking the AI workflows option in the top nav bar. You can see all my workflows are public here. That is it for this video. If you find this video useful, please support me by hitting the like button and subscribing to this channel if you haven't done so yet.